So on Saturday, November 20th, uh, a busload of students and spouses and a few faculty went from IPFW to Cleveland to visit the Cleveland Museum of Art, uh, which is hosting an exhibition on reliquaries, medieval reliquaries. Uh, reliquaries are containers for sacred objects. Uh, they're often made from precious materials so that the precious materials can symbolize the often humble appearance of the relics within, which can often be splinters, parts of the bone, and so they're very, very deluxe objects, and objects that are often excluded from the traditional narratives of medieval art. They're not mosaics and frescoes and manuscript illumination. So, for example, in the two main art history survey textbooks, there are very few reliquaries uh, included among the objects covered, discussed in the textbooks. So it's, it's a very, very special exhibition. Uh, there are not uh, medieval exhibitions in the United States that frequently and seldom on the scale. It really is what I would call a medieval blockbuster. And so it was great for the students to feel the need to go to the work of art. And uh, in general, in the department, we also are very keen to provide opportunities and to see our students eager to, to see art in person. So medieval art, of course, is mostly about context. It's all about context, the reliquary in context, the book in context, being in the church or the library in which the art was made and intended to be used. That's really hard to replicate on this side of the Atlantic. But that, accepting that we can't do that, this was the next best thing. Oh,